Hey, yo, hey, yo, we bad, we bad, we bad, we bad. Yes, sir. What's going on, everybody? It's your boy Toshi. We are. Yeah, yeah, hey, hey. Back at it again. It's your first time catching me. Just know I was live over on the Twizzish, so make sure you go hit the link in the description and catch your boy. Stay updated. We live over on the Twitch right now. Y'all know the name of that move? What's goody? You got the Noti gang in here. You know what I mean? We had We Ice Bear, Amal, Papa. What's goody? We out here, man. You already know. Early stream today. We about to get it popping. Got a few things to watch. But let's get into it. All right, today we got a special stream. We're about to get into episode two of My Home Hero season one, the real life series, the real life anime. I got a special guest with me. Somebody that I've been wanting to stream with, someone that's got good reactions. It's the amazing, the astounding, the incomparable, she's dangerous. All the way from Miami, Sierra. There she is. I can't hear you. Wait, I have to oh, do Oh, I got I, you. I, yeah, I can hear you. I got you. You got to do what? You on stream. Hey, 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 hey. hey Papa uh, said, you wait for that. Papa said, damn, I thought it was me. Hey. Bam, 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 bam. No, it's not Papa. Yeah. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. It's me. Ice Bear, you thought it was going to be Papa also? Damn. All right, then I'm just going ahead and just find my way out because <laughs> nobody want me here. They just want Papa. Because <laughs> I said Miami. <laughs> yeah, Papa said it sounds fire. He said, finally, nice to meet you. Fire. Just want to make sure all the levels is lit. Let's do it. Before we get into this anime. Last week, I reacted to My Home Hero, episode one, and it was kind of crazy. And... It's not an action anime. It's just strictly real life shit. I you know I put Sierra on and she was fucking with episode one. I was like, yeah, let's just figure out, we could figure out a way how to stream so we can get your reaction to it because of how the first episode went. How'd you enjoy the first episode? It was crazy, bro. I, I, okay, honestly, I thought that so much shit was happening at one time. It was like a lot in one episode. Like first, Shorty's getting abused. But then Shorty's abuser gets killed by Shorty's father. And then Shorty's father's wife, he was on board with the killing. And then it was just like, what? She but got we love real crazy. Die. We love her to die. But it was That's a right. lot. I wasn't expecting that out of an anime. She wasn't expecting that out of an anime. I hear this. You hear this, Popo? Popo's not an anime head. He don't fuck with anime. He don't know how good it is. It's not right. <laughs> <laughs> She don't know. She don't know. Papa said anime is dog shit. Papa don't see Papa don't know nothing, man. See? He go, Papa, stay in your little bubble. All right. Stay in your little bubble. All you do is play Warzone. And all he does is press next on a DJ setup oh, at, at at brunches in Miami. Oh shit. You didn't have to go for his all he does is work. He goes, uh next y'all like this song no next that's how papa dj <laughs> yeah i know dj dj i know papa here right now papa's in his little war zone bubble he don't do nothing but use his thumbs and his one finger he said yeah hell yeah i've been scamming making hella money pressing buttons <laughs> <laughs> hey i gonna hold you actually some djs ain't djs they just be really yeah, do it. playing next they really do just be next and shit and getting bread off of it so hey we out here, man, and uh, let's get into it. Do my little dance, dance. Hey. Do my little dance, dance. Hey, I'm nervous. So, so, what is this? What do you think is gonna happen? What is we we do a really good job of like predicting shit. Okay. So where did it leave off? Okay, so the last thing we seen was last episode. Oh boy, got caught. The the spy pulled up. The spy, remember? Yes. He watched him leave. And then he was like, oh, shit, let me go check out what's up. And then he started uh, unlocking the door handle. And Pops was like, he was standing there with the knife. Dude went inside. And then he opened the bathroom door. And then that was it. That was the last thing we saw. Yes. So we don't know. Okay. You so, me, but I'm here. 
So what I'm thinking is Pops was going to have to body him. Like, he has no choice. Oh. Where but, the fuck did Pops get all this shit to, like, body somebody? He's some regular, regular ass detective I mean, and he's bodying burgers? Like... I mean, <laughs> he... he The rice cooker was on hand, so that came in handy. <laughs> yeah. And then... And then, uh... Now, yeah, you know the rice cooker jingle. And now he... He had a knife in his hand because he was gonna chop up the body. That was the reason why he wow. had the knife in his hand. He literally was about to go cut up the body into pieces, but he got caught. So I think he's going to have to body two people. Also, the thing is, is another dude outside waiting for the spy to get back. So that's where she oh, gets okay. tricky. You know what I mean? Like that's... Know that. so yeah. He's going to body him. And the dude's going to be, be like, like, where oh, you at? The other guy's going to come up, huh? Yeah, exactly. The other guy's going to have to go up. And then he's gonna be triple. This dude's gonna kill three people in one day. I she don't know. Like, bro, I only got you on one. I don't know. Like, you killed three motherfuckers. I mean, it's all to save their daughter, right? To protect their daughter. Or what if the spy that comes in? What if he sees the body and he's like, "Oh shit!" And then they end up like getting together like a little ruse so that he doesn't have to kill them. What if they team up? Hey, that might be a thing because they wasn't fucking with the son. They weren't. Remember, they was like, yeah, oh, they was like, if he, the son, yeah, right? they was like, if he wasn't blah 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 son already, we would have. He would have been dead. So God. true. They might be like, oh shit, you killed him. They might. All right, well, you owe us a favor. They, it's because it's it's still the mafia, yeah, you know. It's God still God. yakuza. They're gonna be like, yeah, like I, right, you killed him. We'll keep it on the hush. We'll keep you safe. But at the same time, you gotta do something for us. I don't, I don't know, but I don't know what pops could do well, and then for he them. Gets pulled in, and now he has to do their bidding to protect himself, but also his shorty. Oh, I mean, yeah. Now you can turn and make it to other stories rather than he just kills. Right. Okay. True. Let's see, let's see. All right. Oh, so he he left to follow the daughter. What the fuck? Oh, so pops. somebody's there to clean the house. That's Pops. Pops is Pops is posing as a cleaner. Ah, uh, I didn't even think about this option. I didn't even think about this option. He's posing as a cleaner. He literally was like, so now he's acting like he was like, oh, they, they hired me to clean the place while they're gone. Uh oh, where's the phone? Rings in his pocket. Oh fuck! It is in his pocket. You dumb bitch! You didn't think of that? No, 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 no! It is outside the coverage area. What does that even mean? That means it's outside the coverage area, my boy. So he couldn't get through. So he couldn't even connect, which is lucky for him. He will probably judge me because I'm just eating these snacks. Worst case scenario is they'll abduct her. He destroyed the phone. Good uh, shit. I don't know about the GPS, shorty. Yeah, I don't know about the GPS, but he's fucked up the service, but I don't know about the GPS. I don't know about barefoot. Mm -hmm. As Japanese, you got every you never you can't wear shoes in Japanese homes. You gotta take your shoes off at the door. Wait, why is he acting like hey honey, welcome back? What? Like you didn't just body somebody and they're not just laying in your fucking tub. <laughs> Suitcase is perfect. They're gonna put his body in a suitcase? They're gonna put his body in the suitcase into a pot and cook the body in it. What the? What? <laughs> Throw his ass in the rice cooker. <laughs> Wait. He's gonna look. They're getting into science. No fucking way. Do you hear this shit? I've never heard of this. Wait, I kind of want to try it. Not with hey. like a person, but like. Well, I mean, what do you mean, meat? That's what meat does. Meat does that. You know, it shrinks. All meat shrink when you cook it. Steaks. I don't eat meat. Oh, yes. Chicken, steak, everything shrinks when you cook it. Wait. But what's what's crazy is he got a copper plate, some aluminum. He's making he's making a he's tub and like hot. Look. Like oh. Yeah, look. Heat insulators. I've never seen that. Oh, he's smart. Wow. Look at him. He's smart. This dude made. I ain't never. I ain't never seen that. 
Wait, oh, I, wow. I, I thought he was going to cut him into pieces. He's just shrinking the body. He's going to cook. Uh-oh. But what about the bone? He can't shrink bone. Nah. They just, they just need him small enough to fit inside the suitcase. So this is a Japanese funeral. This is what they do. They do cremations in Japan. They don't do burials. So you cremate, and then that's why the chopsticks, you know, you, you pass one bone to the, another family member. That's why you don't pass food from chopstick to chopstick. And that's why you don't put your chopsticks inside the food like that up straight up because it's a it's a funeral ritual. It worked. Oh. Wait, you're taking the body home? Yo. Wait, you brought the suitcase with the body, cooked body in it, home. She got tundas, okay. Usually they make all the women in in anime with some little tundas. Do they know what that is? Papo might uh -huh. guess. Because Papo, you know, he in he in the uh in Miami. Whoa! Was she a magician? Right. The fuck just happened? Hey, <laughs> sure you're learning magic tricks. Oh on Netflix. Netflix? <laughs> Pops is exhausted. He cooked the whole human today. Is that what is that what he's eating? No, he's not eating the body. That was wild. Damn, the things the parents would do. Oh yeah. I would have moved. He's tripping. I would have dipped. She over here watching the horror. Oh, Pops is. Yeah, Pops is. Yep, of course. He just bodied somebody. That's gonna. That's Bro, definitely gonna shit. leave you. With nightmares for sure. Hey yo, he's breaking this shit down. Look at it. I can dry the bones, but the fl yo, he's. Wait, he he know a little bit too much about this. Hold on, let's pause it for That's a second. That's what I'm saying. Yo, pops is smart. He's gonna dry the bones out, so he's gonna make the bones into dust. So you're not even gonna be able to find the bones. Okay, first of all, you're a detective, Shorty. Like, he's like a sheriff. You know what I mean? Like, if you think about, like, some old hillbilly-ass town, like, that's who he is. He shouldn't know how to, the, like... No, nah, but he's... Decomposition I mean, of a body. He but if you're... To cook a body. Well, if you're... No, but if you're... If you're... It's science. It's act all at the end of the day, right? It's science, anatomy, biology. But it's not... It's not common knowledge. No, nobody... It's not common... Him. Yeah, you're right. It's not common knowledge. So, he, I mean, he's just smart, though. He's just a real smart dude. No, that's like... That's like smart, smart. To even think about that? Uh -oh. That's too smart. Both of them is kind of smart, though. Look. Mm. Even mom's on the lookout. She said that carbon. Yeah, I think they were both like CIA agents or some shit. Ain't no fucking way. Regular, regular yeah. parents. Wow. She said it was there last night too. Wow. Yeah, pops is. Pops is smart. They're smart. It's a smart couple. Power couple. Bonnie and Clyde moment. They not following. Mmm, it's shorty. Uh oh, you should text your wife at least. Been prepared. Maybe he did. Uh oh. Oh shit! Wait. Wait, I'm so fucking. Somebody was following him. Oh, uh huh. Look at him. See, smart. Pops is smart. He's too smart. He's too smart. It's sus. It's not adding up. It doesn't make sense. Like fan. Oh no. Should I call wifey? So he has to find a way to get the body out of the crib and be able to dispose of it without being caught. And everybody, the whole family's being monitored. Oh, shit. How does she even know that term? No way. That makes sense, though. Wow. But this is how you start a compost. Like, if you even want to do it at your house. Because this is what I wanted to, this is what I would like to do when I get home, is have my own compost. 
Shorty, we can't do that. Oh, no, 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 no. They about to do. They about to run up in the crib. Okay, so he's about to break in. Yeah, he's going to break in and look around. You know, property appraiser. Yo, look how the mob works, though. They, they're... There's some real shit though. Okay, wait. So that, so that, so that's part of the mob. It's not like a thing. No, nah, this is a dude that they, he's distracting them. Got it. Oh. The daughter, the daughter just feels weird energy. Oh. I mean, she. There's smart parents. They gotta have a smart daughter, right? But she was fucking with a dude that was whipping her ass, so I don't know how smart no, she is. That bitch is dumb as fuck. Okay, yeah. this nigga we served on the daughter. Okay, she has no sense of anything. He said, buy more like, time. Like, What's this? What did he see? He's seen something. Uh oh. Ops is smart. Oh no, the bag. Where's the bag? Uh oh. The daughter is gonna find out. Oh shit, is he in there? Yeah. The daughter. Why am I only one digging out here? He's in the he's in the fucking ship with all the beds. The body's right there. He was too busy hiding and didn't realize the body was right next to him. Wow. Wow. God, this is too much. What's that on the floor? She's gonna take a bath. Wait, she's gonna take a bath. Isn't that where they cook, Shorty? Oh no, that was at her apartment. Look, look, look. She noticed the table was moved. That's what it was. She noticed that when she was vacuuming, you could see the, the groove mark right there. See it? That mm -hmm. means somebody moved the table. And look at that. It's a fucking device. Somebody was. Mm. Oh, shit. Ooh. <laughs> this is crazy. They made a script. They're reading from a script and setting them up to make it seem like they're just innocent parents looking out for their, their daughter. Oh, good setup. Good setup. No, bro, they're too good. They're secret spy agents. They're basically like There's spy. No fucking way. No way. Right? Good question, Ma. The way you setting shit up, right? <laughs> right? So he reads a lot. He le he reads a lot of mystery stories. What's that? Let's go, wifey. Listen, we live around her die. Come on, shorty. She's like, this is my first rodeo. Why is she smiling, though? It's trying to, it's, it's hard. Boy. Uh -huh. I mean, that's mentally crazy, right? You actually took a life. If you're a normal person, you just took a life. Yeah. It's got to, it's got to weigh on you, your conscience, you know? Have a good day, my boy. There is no good day after that. <laughs> Everything is buried now. And they just got to wait for that bitch to dissolve. <laughs> this bitch. <laughs> Why does she kind of aggravate me with her naiveness? I don't, it's because she got smart ass parents and she's dumb as fuck. <laughs> Just don't get it. Uh oh. Oh! Oh, shit! No! They're not killing her, are they? Oh my god, they're kidnapping the whole fam. Oh, fuck. Wait, why did Bonnie show me like that? They didn't. No, I don't think they body. They didn't body her. They uh, they just kidnapping them. They not. No, but they but, did not need to yaga like that. I like, know they. They, her. they for sure did. That shit was like, Ooh. yeah, they fucked her whole shit up. Wow. Whoa. Okay. That's crazy. This shit. But see, do you see what I mean? Like so much shit happens in one episode. episode? And you're like, wait, fuck. That's how, and you like, see, it's good writing, though. You see how the way they write it? But that, that's, that's... It was unexpected, sus. though. I think it is sus. Some shit is going to come out about these parents. Right? Is somebody lying? Because the wifey's so okay with it. I think she's the one that's like... Cause she's caught she a body before? Right. She's you like, think, 
you think, for Twitter? You think, it's not for me. You know what I mean? Like, I, that energy. <laughs> hey, Shorty's an assassin. <gasps> nah, I don't think they're... I don't know. Somebody's got a dark past. I mean, Pops was acting like... He was saying he's weak. You know, they're doing it to protect. They don't want to lose their daughter. Yeah. And they're true. doing it to protect. So if they can... If they can play the part of innocent parents, they might be able to get away. But what's fucked up is that they're just so suspicious of them because they're too... I don't know. I, I don't even know. They the, the mob isn't believing it. Yakuza's like, nah, they, so, it's too fishy. Something's fishy. It's, they're just like a normal family. They're too normal. But that's... I don't know. I, how is that suspicious, you know? I mean, there is such thing as being too fucking normal. You know what I mean? Like, it is weird, because there is no such thing as, like, a picture-perfect household, especially so, like, if they know that their daughter was getting fucking popped. You know what I mean? So, like, like what's kidnapping going to do? Just have them under their control. But then what? You know, I like... I don't know. Because they, they, they mentioned a stalker, so they're going to have to try to find a fake stalker. They're going to be like, oh, y'all... So she has a stalker. Do y'all know who he is? What's his name? Da -da -da -da. Anything about him? Damn. I don't know the, what direction this is going. Pops. Seriously, it can go in either direction. It can go in can go so many. And the fucking daughter is clueless. <laughs> She's just... Daughter is completely clueless. <laughs> She's just head in the clouds. She's a fucking... <laughs> yeah, exactly. Did did is is right. She's a fucking dick You know what I mean? So she's like, oh my God, where am I? It's, it's kind of like, it's kind of like taken a little bit when they like kidnap the parents. Yeah. And she has to go like find her, her. But I think oh. they, they got the whole family. Oh, so they also kidnapped the daughter. Yeah, yeah. They got, they're going to have the whole family. They're going to line up the family. It's probably going to take them straight to the boss. Maybe not straight to the boss, but they'll probably have them go to the interrogator and then they're just going to be interrogated. They might be tortured to try to get the truth. And now this is where moms and pops might have to endure torture. What if, I think it's moms. I think moms are gonna body. I think she's just gonna be like, oh, you think I can't take this shit? Fucking get waterboarded. Like, blah, 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 blah. And then just be like, like, I think she's gonna raw dog this shit and she's gonna be like, fucking fire. The dad's gonna pussy out. I don't think he gonna pussy out. I don't think he gonna pussy out. out. I think no. they're in it. I think pops and moms are in it. Like they're in it. They're in it to the, to the end. I don't think, the end, yeah. The daughter, I mean, the daughter's been popped a couple of times. I think she'll be fine. Yeah, but she don't know shit. Like, she literally doesn't know anything. So, yeah, please. So, for real, she knows no information. So, really, for them, they're going to be like, like, oh, like, so she's going to find out about like, like everything. Yeah, like, is it going to come down to them torturing the daughter and be like, you know what? We're just going to kill your daughter if you don't tell us what the they're fuck's like, going on. Right, like they're gonna have to admit it, right? Because they don't want they don't want nobody they don't want to lose their daughter. But at the same time, it's gonna be like if we do tell them, somebody's gonna die. If we do tell them, like you know, if pops confesses, I killed him to so try to save mom and daughter. Right, but if moms might do the same thing, be like I killed him to save father and the daughter. So one of the parents might sacrifice what themselves. What if the daughter is like I did it to save her parents? Ooh, that's that'd be a plot twist. Cause right because now she don't seem like she give a fuck though. Getting the beatings, right. So she has motive is her house. True, true. She might maybe maybe but, the daughter be, be like, I love my parents too much, so fuck it. I'll just confess to the shit that I didn't do. But she wasn't there though. They know that she wasn't there because they saw her leave. Oof, this is tough. This is <laughs> I love this because you un, I don't know what the fuck's gonna happen. Like this is the type of shit we can't I don't predict know it. Either. This is a great series. It's very unpredictable. I don't know what's gonna <laughs> I don't know what the fuck's gonna happen. <laughs> wow, what a great series. Uh real life anime shit. That was hard. Uh any you had any last comments about it? But that's pretty much it. I'm good. I'm just like That's pretty we'll much it. The, we'll see what happens. And the plot thickens. Let's that's see what happens. Let's see what happens next time. But let me know what you thought of that episode. And that was My Home Hero. All right. But right now, we're about to get into this new series. It's on Hulu. It's being suggested Tengoku Daimakyo Heavenly Delusion. We're about to get into these first two episodes. So far from what I'm seeing, anime, the animation quality looks lit. Yeah, the, the art style looks fire. Like Sidious is saying, 
given that that promised Neverland season one, and we know how that shit was. Fire. So let's get into it. It's a small ass class. Why they all look like chefs? I mean, heavy promised Neverland vibes already. Do you want to go outside of the outside? Post-apocalyptic vibes, huh? Okay, Last of Us type shit. Oh, it's giving me movie vibes for sure. I look like mocap. She got a gun too on hand. You know, in Japan, guns are rare. Ooh, a fresh toothbrush. So this place hasn't been raided. Bodies on the bed. Yep, I knew it. Wow. They died of starvation. What a way to go. So if, you, if you're if picking weeds from around this land right there, it's probably definitely... It's all good. You still got to eat it. Fuck it. Fill that belly. What did they survive? What the fuck is that? Is that strings coming off the bird? What in the alien? Uh oh, it's an ambush. <laughs> she was like, I'm a boy too. It's a fake gun. Uh oh. Is it a real gun though? He got the sauce? Let's go! Oh, he's got the sauce. Ooh, B twist off the gate. Oh, nah. What the fuck? Was that a, uh, uh, it, it wasn't a bullet. It was, a like a ray gun almost. Okay. Hey, dude, the little kid is saucy. <laughs> What's up? Y'all want these hands? Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah, it's got to be. If I get my ass kicked. So what you got? One shot? She don't got proper gun etiquette. She got her finger on the trigger. Oh, no, she got it out. Okay. So it's got four shots in it. So it seems like these are one of them colonies that was able to put themselves in a box and survive and shut out the outside world. So these kids have been raised in the, in the inside their entire lives. Oh, he just jumped off the first. Oh, okay. He, okay, this is a little, okay, that's not natural. He got some sauce to him. I think these kids are some type of experiments because the way he was just moving, he threw a ball, jumped off the first story so at least, that's got to be at least 15 feet. Boom, boom, flip, land, ran, and caught the ball before it hit the ground. That's superhuman. Okay, at least they didn't hide the truth. Or, you know, like, they didn't hide it. They said, oh, you found out about that, huh? Well, yeah, there is an outside. He said, I think I'm 15. They're not even keeping track of years. Batteries are rare, huh? There's no power. Oh, shit. She's scarred up. That's crazy. She got scars on both sides of her body. What's she doing? Kissing herself? Damn, she's scarred up, though. True. Like, who's even keeping track of birthdays, right? Hiru Beam. She created that? Uh-oh. She letting the pot overboil. What's up with that? She knocked on the door. Is there someone else there? Oh. <laughs> she think they trying to get it, get each other's cheeks right now. She's like, look, having kids with a family member is not the way to do it. Damn. He thinking they, he's like, he's been calling her sis. You said he's nothing to you. No, the lady, the lady, uh, put something in they shit. She's gonna feed them. Wait, what is happening? A shotgun? Oh shit! Is the lady gonna feed the bird, the kids? 
So this is what she does. Oh, that's fucking weird. But that's fucked up, man. It's survival. Seems like she made a deal with this monster to bring it food for her survival. That's what I'm thinking. Oh, this is kind of crazy. Yo, it's always, it's always survival. People will do any fucking thing to save their own ass. Okay, we didn't get an intro last one. It was a straight episode. Now we get a little, see what this intro talking about. What's this shit called? It's called Heaven, Heaven. What's this shit called again? And uh, uh, it's Tengoku Daimaki. Daimakyo, which is heavenly, heavenly delusion. There it is. So she is smart. They always got running anime. Like you got to run in the intro. It's always the music video intro slit. This concept is different. I like it. So this kid's got some type of condition that's fucking him up. The girls making out. I mean, they don't have many people to fuck around with, right? Oh, they're not normal. Wait, how is she holding on to the tree with one hand? She's upside down holding the tree with one hand. Ain't no way. She's gripping the top of a tree, the bottom of a branch, like this. You're palming the bottom of a branch and you're just kicking it on the side? Nah, none of these kids are normal. They're, they're a uh, homunculus. They're a mix. Oh yeah, they on some shit. What's going on? She sent the nude. Hey, yo, chill. What are we watching? Ain't these kids? They over here sexting? These, this one collects art. Uh-oh. Is your gun. Maybe the lady, I'm, she did drug him. Is she trying to save him now? So confused. Nah, trying to fight a monster in the pitch black? Hmm. She got four shots. What is that? It's got some shit whipping around it. Ooh. What? They dodged it? How did he see those and even decipher that it got? Nah. And how does she not even see this happening? This big ass thing chasing him. She gonna shoot it from the back? Oh no, she gonna fuck up. They whole shit. What? Oh shit. Oh shit. Whoa, okay, now shit is getting. Motherfucker said, fuck you, mom. Oh, a double slice? Oh. Oh. Whoa. It's fucked up. Well, he gonna kill it with his bare hands? What's he about to do? What the fuck? This nigga had the power to reach inside? Okay, what the fuck is going on? Wow. Okay, so they're both crazy. So he, I'm, I'm gonna say they might be a part of the generation that came out of the walls. They might have escaped the walls somehow from like another, from another facility. Cause this kid is OP with his combat skills and they're both very analytic. They're both like, she was like, did you see that? Like he instantly said, oh, six whips, three on the left, three on the right. Got it. How did you see that? They motherfuckers is moving so fast. They're moving so fast that they sliced through this lady like it was butter. Not even butter, like it was fucking, I don't even know. He said, stop. And then he noticed that they only whip one way. And there was a pause between the attacks. They are smart. But holy shit. Nah, Donna's gonna fuck with this. This is crazy. They have the power to kill them. He touched it. And it a fucking hand went into the body and grabbed the heart and ripped it out. And rightfully so, you don't know what the fuck's in the water, so you're gonna be scared, right? I'm afraid of water. Fuck water. The ocean is scary. 
See? They inventing shit? Damn! Oh my god, he just fell from what? He survived that? That had to be like a six. That had to be like four, maybe five stories high. He fell flat on his back and survived. That means they got they got durability. They're showing us like the little bit of durability they have. Wait, you got a twin out there? Hmm. I wonder, is that the kid in the wheelchair? I gotta go look at that kid in the wheelchair from earlier. One that had that shit on him. I wonder if that's the kid who has his face. You know what I'm talking about? That's the only other that's the only person I could think about right now. Because he's sick. She had that same sickness the kid got. Oh yeah, the kid. So the kid in the wheelchair had, he had like an arm, he had something on his arm and his legs and shit was wrapped up. That's why he was in a wheelchair because he had that same color, like discoloration on his skin. So I'm assuming there's some type of disease that's killing these augmented people. And that, that needle is probably the cure. And then maybe they're able to use that kid's blood to recreate it. This is really on some Last of Us type shit. Okay, so we got a small sustainable village. Oh, he blazing. She said, we grow all types of crops. And then he saw dude smoking. She out there dancing, dancing in her underwear with a blanket. Oh, they high as shit. We already know. We already know what they smoking. Man, y'all just be trusting people. Yeah, see, they out there high. Shit, I mean, I mean, come on. In reality, if you, if you can have a self-sustainable village where you're growing fresh fruits and vegetables, and you got fresh water, right? And you're living fine. And then you can grow some tree. Oh, that's the life. Give me that. That's all I want. Give me a little compound somewhere off to myself. I got a full garden where I could, I could juice and I can eat fresh off my own land. I got some trees too. Oh, I'm, I'm chilling for the rest of my life. That's what Bear Grylls is doing. Wait, she's famous? <laughs> he was like, that's not her. Oh, shit. Uh, they do look kind of alike. We got a mysterious symbol. Farming all day, getting high at night. <laughs> what? That shit it sounds nice as fuck. Well, from what they were talking about earlier, he said when this shit happened, she would have been around five years old. And she's 20 now. So this happened about 15 years ago because he's 15, right? So shipping shit happened right as he was born. Oh, he's falling for her. He shot his shot. She identifies as a man. Here we go. Uh, him, him being a 15 year old kid growing up in this world, he probably never even heard of anything like this, but she said, my body's a woman, but my brain is a man. So she identifies as a man. It looks like compasses didn't work. This kid. So it's technically an adventure story, but obviously a post-apocalyptic one. Okay. Tengoku Daimakyo. Daimakyo. Dai. Daimakyo. Daimakyo. Tengoku Daimakyo. Something different. 100% giving me Promise Neverland vibes. Animation is fire. You feel like you're watching a mini movie for sure. The concept is out there. You have man-eating monsters that I, I don't know what caused the apocalypse. I'm gonna assume first that it was this disease. She's on a mission from somebody that they got this mission from. She was on her deathbed. She gave her the gun, told her to go to heaven, but protect this kid on the way. He was told to protect her on her way to heaven as well. He has a needle that he needs to put into someone that looks like him. So I'm, not, I'm thinking twin or I'm thinking clone. But we also see that there's a kid in this facility that has the same condition that the chick was dying. They have the same skin condition uh, that seems like obviously they're on their way out. So I don't know how long this kid has, but I'm assuming that's the kid that he has to inject with the needle that would hopefully create some type of cure that they can help and share with everybody. These are just top little pieces I'm trying to put together and figure out. They're giving us the world, right? We got bandits, 
And this is Japan, okay? So we got bandits. They look like regular people that just gather together to try to, you know, be something. They got their asses kicked. Everybody that's over a certain age isn't going to have a specific power. Now, I don't know where these kids getting these powers from, how they're as so advanced, and I don't know. There's something up with that. We have to get into that story. On why are these kids so advanced? Why are they fucking superhuman? Why are they mutants? Why are they whatever they are? They're very smart. They have durability, strength, speed, analytic abilities. And these are two kids on the outside. So we're getting the perspective of the outside world and we're also getting perspective of the closed off world. Now I think that place that they're in is called heaven or so-called heaven. So that's where they're trying to get to. <clears throat> they just have to figure out how to get there. Something different, something interesting. I'm Obviously, we're going to give it the three episode rule to lock us in. So the third episode that comes out this Friday uh, or Saturday or something like that. But I should lock us in to see if we're going to continue this. But the concept is fire. If the story can pan out, if it has really good storytelling, this could be a great one for this season. I'm not sure the readers out there. I'm not sure what they're talking about, but I'm hoping that it's good. Um, I'm going to look. I'm going to look it up on. So I'm, I just wanted to see some comments. So I wanted to check out uh, nine anime. So I'm on nine anime right now. And people are saying that this is going to be a fire anime. People are fucking with it. From the looks of it, it looks great. I'm looking at the comments. It seems obviously people are talking about uh, people are talking about her being identifying as a man. Obviously, that's like the biggest thing for the second episode, which whatever. she She's a man. Got it. Who gives a fuck? She don't fuck with men. But there's a lot of details in this, I think, that you just have to pay attention to. And like the shit will start to unfold for itself because she was looking at herself in a mirror. She kissed herself. Remember, she was about to kiss herself. And then there's like a chick that looks like her, but isn't isn't her. Maybe that's her old identity and she dyed her hair. So she was actually a race car driver or some shit like there's there's a lot of mystery to unfold on all ends of this anime yeah i mean it's just a lot of shit to unfold and we're only in the first two episodes and they're giving us a lot of details they're giving us a lot of details to pay attention to so you watched it on hulu mcray j yeah me too i watched it on hulu i just wanted to see some comments to see what people thought about it i went to nine anime for that heavenly delusion something fresh and fire something different and i'm excited I'm excited to see what episode three brings because that can be the game changer. But the animation quality, mm, it's looking real nice. Let me know what you thought of that. And that was Heavenly Delusion. And there you have it. You already know what time it is, man. Go ahead and I don't even know. Mom, I'm so discombobulated. What a day. But I appreciate you for tuning in. Checking your boy out live. If you're just not catching this on YouTube, make sure you go follow your boy. Link in the description. Toshi Adventures across all platforms. And I'll see you guys next time. As always, have fun. Stay fly. Be free. I'm out.